Now in this next experiment, we're going to be making a catapult. Now this is perfect for students in second and third grade because not only does it teach them how to work with certain everyday materials, it also teaches them to use it in a different way. We're going to get springiness out of regular wood and elasticity out of different materials. So using standard materials, they'll be able to make a launcher and also if they launch it over and over, they're going to begin to see the physics of projectile motion, which usually they don't get until they're in junior high. So this is a great way to get them introduced to the idea of the laws of gravitation as well as elasticity of materials. Are you ready? Let's get started. Stack seven popsicle sticks together and secure each end with a rubber band. Take two more popsicle sticks and secure only one end with a rubber band. Open up the two popsicle sticks and insert your larger stack inside. Using a large rubber band, wrap it around three sides of the catapult, making sure not to put a rubber band on this side. Hot glue a plastic spoon to the top of the catapult. This is going to hold your projectile. Simply grasp your catapult, pull back, and let go. If you want more free experiments like this, just visit my website at www.bestsciencelearning.com. I've got dozens of experiments and videos and tons of resources to help you and your kids learn science. My focus is not just on teaching science, but in helping kids develop a real sense of fascination and personal interest in it. So go ahead and download your free copy of the Science Experiment and Activity Guide, plus free experiment videos and more right now. Go to www.bestsciencelearning.com right now and get your free experiments. Happy experimenting. I'll see you in the lab.